guys. <laughs> Another tarny vlog. <clears throat> I'm sorry guys. I've had some lovely comments from you lot. I really have. Telling people, you know, to people have said, you know, you keep you keep doing these vlogs if they help you and stuff. And, well, I think they do. I don't know. So, day four today. I don't feel any better. doing these because I think I'd like to just show people that you know you, you get good days and you get bad days you know I, I think at the beginning they all feel bad <laughs> but I, I think they gradually I mean I, I, I think gradually I feel I'm getting moving on do you know what I mean but it, it's a, I'm having a bad day today or so far I, I where I looked I could see her. Do you know what I mean? I, I, I think the worst time I had this morning was when I was sat eating my breakfast and um, the visitor came downstairs and I thought oh, I want just somebody to talk to. I'll have a chat with Tara and of course I looked down she wasn't there was she? So hence I've gone out. I've been driven out my own house. Yes, anyway, I've come out, it's, it's just gone half eight. Get out, make the most of every bloody minute you've got. 
because you never know when it's your last. You know, a couple of days and you can what? A few minutes even and you can be gone. Just like that. Yeah. I'm sorry these do go on a bit. <laughs> I'll be amazed if I'll be amazed if many people are watching the whole lot. <laughs> I don't think many people are gonna watch all of it. I really don't. It's just it's just too depressing, isn't it? Who the hell's gonna watch all these things? <laughs> no one's gonna watch all this. I reckon they watch the first five minutes. This feels raw. This feels really raw. Because this was the last walk I took her on before she went. God, that feels rough. This was the last walk we had. I don't know if I, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know if this is punishing me or what. This is a bit like Goblin Coombe the other night. That was horrendous. That just felt so empty. I was glad I did it though. I think the same. Same for the day. Same for today. Come on, let's go. Let's let's get out. There's the van. Here's me. We tripod this morning. Just all these memories. It'd be like now, she'd be, she'd be sat at the gate here. Oh God, God, it's rough. Go on then, Smelly. God, it's raw this morning. It really does. <coughs> God, Jesus Christ. See, I'm even looking behind for her and she's not there. Oh, it's rough. Oh, I don't feel bad today. Hello. Got all this lot in here. Look at them all. Can you see them? She went in. <laughs> yeah, you'll you'll see the vid, guys. I'll I'll try and put that one up today if I get time. I'm still uploading day three. That's um, I think that's uploading at the moment at this present time. I'm making this. <coughs> Just hoping my battery's okay on this play sport because I didn't have a chance to charge it up. That should be alright. <sighs> See, I feel for myself. Oh, that's stupid, isn't it? Oh, a dog poo. How many things you miss? Oh, God. 
I was just saying how, how stupid it sounds, but I, I want a dog lead. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? I want to I want to take a dog lead with me. This was quite this was this, this was reasonably local to us, so we used to I used to come a lot down here with her. Well, as you can probably tell in some of my videos, I suppose there's probably about four or five vids of this place around here. This just doesn't have any feeling to it anymore. All I can. S God, I'm having a bad day today. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I don't know if you can hear me or not, guys. I'm. S I hope you can. Well, I hope I can hear myself. Because, you know, I need to watch these. I've watched some of these vlogs about five or six times each one I've made. It definitely helps, it definitely helps, seems to help me. It gets, gets me sort of see how I'm feeling from a different perspective, if you see what I mean. I just hope you can hear, I really do. Oh, <coughs> I can't. The wind's coming in from the north, and of course I'm walking in the wrong direction. Oh, so I just hope you can hear. She loved it down here. There was oh, so many sticks. <laughs> you know, there were so many sticks. I suppose like the wood. I think she, I don't know. I think I think she probably enjoyed the beach more than she did. I think she was probably a bit of a water dog. Well, she was. That's why we called her Tarn. Am I recording? Yes, that's right. That's why we called her Tyne, because she liked water so much. Really into water. Yeah. All these emotions are all, um... I just feel numb again now. <laughs> I, was, I was crying again just a minute ago, and now I'm just numb. <laughs> just totally numb. Thing is, these are these are feelings that you feel. It's you can't. Oh, I don't mind. I'll go out and record it again. You can't, can you? Do you know what I mean? It's when you've done, it's just done. It's done. God, it just feels so empty. It just don't feel right at all. Do you know what I mean? I'm. You look down there. Saying so, you know, I'm expected, I'm just looking for her all the time. I mean, I'm, I know she's gone. I know she's gone, and I think I think part of the grieving process for me is um, it's not so much just missing her. It's it's missing doing stuff with her. I suppose. Oh, I don't know. It's just. Do you know what I mean? Does that make any sense? I don't know. I just I don't know. I think I'm just talking at me bum mostly do. I was gonna walk out down through here. Okay, I don't think you can hear me, can you? It's quite it's it's got a bit breezy, a bit windy. I think this is just generally a not very good day today. I can't do my vid logs because I ain't going to hear nothing. I need to talk because I've got to have somebody to talk to. got no dog, so I can't talk to her. Oh. Well, I thought you could walk all the way along. It. I don't care. Look, look, Tarn, there's a stick for you, girl. You ain't gonna hear none of this. You ain't gonna hear, are you? Because it's bloody wind. You ain't gonna hear nothing. Not a thing.
It's just very peaceful down here this morning. See, me and Ty never came in here because it always said no entry. I'll go back that way, I think. We've got the wind behind you now, so hopefully it might be a bit better. Well, customary dog walkers, <laughs> like myself was. I was saying I've got, I've got to get another dog. Oh, I can't cope with this. I can't cope going out now, now having no company. This is horrible. And look at the lovely flowers. I can still see beauty in everything. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? I haven't I haven't lost hope in everything. I just miss my dog. I got I'm trying to shout at the microphone with my hand, but I don't know how successful it is. I just hope I get to listen to these again later. Because this is it's like when you when you take your dog out for a walk, when you take your friend out, you know, there's... That's one in a lifetime. You'll never ever get that moment back again. So every time you go out, you appreciate it. You appreciate every single moment that you go out. Because, well, it's like I said in the last vid, you know, yesterday, you, you'll never appreciate it more until they're gone and you realise you can't do it anymore. Do you know what I mean? Because, um... But then I always did. <laughs> That's one thing with me. I, I didn't... Um, I always did. I, I, I always appreciated every walk we ever went on. Do you know what I mean? There was never, there was never, ever one walk that I ever took her on I did not enjoy. I enjoyed every minute with her. You know, that was the best 14 years of my life. Taking her out and being with her. I mean, I know you, you thing is you moan at them, you go, oh, bloody dog, stop, go on out the way, for goodness sake. Do you know what I mean? But you don't stop loving them. Do you know what I mean? You might think that about your other half, mightn't you? Or your another relative or something like that, you know. You, it might get on your nerves and you think, oh, I've got to say, I wish you weren't around. But you don't really mean it. You just you just think to yourself, you know, it's just, um, it's just that particular moment in time, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? But yeah. Yeah, I've got a few hours to kill, so. I'm not in any rush. That's a nice flower letter, look. That's for you, Torrance. You'd have liked to have had a pee on them, wouldn't you? <laughs> yeah, bless her. She'd have had a pee on them. She'd have thought, they're nice. Yeah, if, um, well, if you ever want to look at any more of me vids down here, go on the... It's, God, it's windy. Go and have a look at, um, look for Kingston Seawall or something like that, because there's a few videos of me and Tarn down here enjoying ourselves. This, I, oh, I can't be bothered to do them now, but there's a load of uh, photographs and stuff down here. Anyway, I was just saying, I'll, um... I'm gonna head back to the van. I was gonna walk, I was gonna walk down there, but um, I'll walk back to. The, it's too windy. It's too windy. I mean, part of what I'm doing, part of the reason I'm doing this is, it's it's me therapy. Can you see I felt better? Do I look better to you? Do I look? Do I feel better since I, since I came up this path just now? And went along there. I feel, I feel better. Do you know what I mean? I feel like I've, I've had a lift. I feel better now. Do you know what I mean? I, I feel. Swap sides. I feel. Um, 
I do, I, I, feel, I feel a little better now. I feel better that I've, um, I feel better, I'm, I feel better I've done these. I feel better I've done the vlogs. I feel better I've got out and I've had a walk. It still ain't right without the, without Smelly, but... I can't do anything about it, can I? So, I'll have to make do. I've got to get another dog. I... Sorry, I changed his sides again. I um, I've got to get another dog. I, uh, I'm not getting a dog to replace Tan. I'll never ever replace her. There's no way in hell I'll ever ever replace her. She was too special. She got a special little place here, and it's too raw. But I got too much love for an animal. Because I've been brought up with them all my life. I... I think she's here. She, I, th I think she's here somewhere. i got visions of her there looking at me. I do might sound all very stupid. But, um... I feel emotional again now. I, I didn't back there. But I feel like... Do you know what I mean? I feel like her summit's with me. I don't know. <coughs> but I've got too much love for another animal that to not have one. <laughs> like it's like I said yesterday, it's I I I haven't not had a dog for nearly seventeen years. Oh, this is chaffinch. <laughs> for seventeen years. Sorry, that's my bad shoulder. I can't hold. I can't hold the camera on this shoulder. I I hurt this shoulder a few years ago. I knocked it out on a mountain bike accident, and yeah, I damaged it, and it's never been right since. Anyway, um, yeah, yeah. I've I've got getting a dog. It's no good. I can't. I can't cope without one. I can't. I just can't cope without one. I'm not doing very well. Is it, I think it's grief, but I mean the whole family's suffering. We're all suffering. My little boy. Oh, he's got he's got his little t he got a little collie puppy teddy bear, obviously called Tarn, and um, he won't let go of it. He won't let go of it. <laughs> You know, he's cuddling it all the time. He takes it to bed with him. Never bothered before. But, you, you know, it's like his way of dealing with the loss of losing her. I mean, he's only five. But he hasn't known any... He hasn't known a day without her. And he'd, uh, even when she was alive, he'd, he'd, he'd sort of sit with her and give her a cuddle and stuff like that. I mean, he didn't really understand because he was only little, but... You know, he loved her to bits. He doesn't know how to express it, really. But he keeps saying, oh, lovely tarn. Lovely tarn. Giving her kisses and stuff like that. This is the teddy. This is what he's doing now. I think my, uh, my wife's the same. She's she's a bit numb at the moment. She's very numb. She doesn't know how to take it. She doesn't know how to cope with it, really. She's just trying to be strong all the time for for my boy, but... I don't think she's done very well. She did on the outside she is, but she's finding it hard. <clears throat> I mean she didn't she didn't spend the time with her that I did. Because obviously she'd go to work and whereas when I when could be in self employed when I was at work, Tarn was with me. If I had the chance, she used to come with me. I used to take her in the van to work with me. <clears throat> Ever since she was a pup. The day she was a puppy, she'd come in the van with me to work. And she always has done, all of her life. You know, like when I'm working in a workshop now. She'd come and sit in a workshop with me. She was always there, always. There's never a moment without her. Like I say, it was only in later years I couldn't take her in the van with me, because um, 
because of her arthritis. She couldn't, she couldn't cope with it because it was too much, too painful for her. You've heard all this before, haven't you? Let me swap again. You've heard all this before. I'm not going to extend this vid for much longer. I, I think this one's gone on plenty long enough. I mean, I'm, I'm going to go and do some more walks now. I've got... I've got... I'm not... I'm not ready to go home yet. If I go home, all I'll do is just go back to another empty house and I'm not prepared for that. So I'm going to try and... Try and just keep walking for a few hours. Like I said the other day, I, I got, I feel I've got to just keep walking. I just got to keep walking. I've got no reason to stop. I just got to keep putting one foot in front of the other. I feel I've got to keep walking for her. Do you know what I mean? I feel it's like a psychological thing. Oh, keep her fit, keep her fit, keep her fit. And like psychologically, I think, oh God, keep her fit, she won't die. Do you know what I mean? So I've got to keep walking and keep walking. I think that's what it is. But it's just a thing that says, oh, as soon, as soon as I'm awake, I've got to get up and go for a walk. I can't stay in. I can't, I just can't, can't stay at home. Anyway, I can't film me doing this all bloody day, can I? It's stupid. Anyway, there's the van. Well, back in the van. Um... I just did a sign off bit on the place for it but the battery went so I thought I'd flick this one in. Yeah, I um I was saying now uh, I hope these vids are useful to somebody. Um I'm I mean I'm, I'm just putting them up for me. I've just watched it all. It's so so it's about half an hour so I'm sorry if it's a bit long again. And um I'll be surprised if anybody watches it to the end anyway. But if you're still here, I could say I hope it's a bit of use maybe. Just to show the progression of grief. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I guess in this, every different, it's going to be different for everybody, isn't it? You know. But just to show that you you will get through it. You will get through it. It just takes time. You know, if just just the fact that if I can share something with other people, if it just helps them, even if it makes them upset, but if it helps them feel better in some sort of way, that that, that we can all feel the same for our animals when they go. Do you know what I mean? I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Like I say, I don't even know what I'm doing these for, really. I've had a few nice comments from people that says, you know, you just keep doing them, but... I don't know. I came across my um incoming call. Sorry about that, it's incoming call. It was in the middle of a video, so um yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, I came across uh, a video. Well I think it was the last but one well no it wasn't the last but one because it was a few weeks back now. I did um the wood spring um, no, Bluebell Wood. I took Tarn on. And, um, just watching her and just seeing the energy she had. I mean, she was tired, but she was still bouncing along with her wagging her tail. And, um, do you know what I mean? It was lovely. It was lovely to watch. It was just lovely to watch her again in the last last few weeks of her life and um i think what got me that um <laughs> this cows to the right of me <laughs> shall i show you no. there they are <laughs> the, the chap's gone down the road and they've they've had a little, they got other ideas. They've gone in the field behind me. Yeah, I um, sorry, I, I'll take my coat off. Yeah, I was saying about the um, that last video I put up about three weeks ago. It, it was really nice to watch her. The last few weeks of her life, still enjoying herself. And um, what upset me the most 
was was it was a nice it was a nice little vid of me taking Smelly for a walk and some bastard had to come and put two thumbs down on it. What a I'm sorry. I had to disable the I had to disable the thumbs down on them. But um I'm pretty sure they weren't there. And I uh, I'm trying really hard not to swear because obviously the sick piece of person who who likes who likes thumbing down my videos has um has obviously decided that huh oh, he's there's one of his last vids he did taking his dog for a walk let's go and thumb it down do you know what i mean i think that's just an effing sick and if you're watching mate i think you're sick you're sick that's all that's all i can say so that's just for you mate if you're watching I think whatever life throws at you, you deserve it if you're doing things like that. I've got nothing for you at all. Nothing. But I'm not going to go down that road because um, I don't want to feel full of hate and horrible stuff because I ain't like that. I'm a better person than that. And anyway, I'm going to get off that saddo. I'm going to... um say thanks for coming guys and again i hope the vids are useful to somebody uh, it's quite a long one this so if you've watched it well, i don't think mr sick man is going to watch to the end because he's obviously too sick in the head to watch more than a few minutes anyway he just wants to thumb down well he can't do it anymore can he because i've disabled them all so hope you guys are all happy and well and um Peace in every step, and I'll see you in the next vid. Well, I just thought I'd tag this on because um, I'm still on day four, and um, I'm not feeling any better. Just walking around where we used to take her for a walk. There's some nice fields back there. This is in Clevedon. I um I've decided we're gonna for the family place to scatter her ashes. I think it's gonna be up on Poet's Walk. I think because that was one of the nicest walks, and it was one of the walks the whole family took part in, not just me. I think that's probably the best place we're gonna go. I think we did shed a few tears just now. I just walked up round there. It's all, um, all a bit raw. Yeah, it's day four and I don't feel any better than I did on day two today. I'm just feeling really right today. Anyway, thanks for coming guys and um, I'll see you in the next video.